Hi, my name is Scott McGregor. I'm the owner of the Adam and Eve in Greenfield, Massachusetts. We've been open since uh, 2010. Uh, we have been growing this store quite well uh, over the last eight years. We have, uh, have a great following. We also do a lot for the community as a member of the Chamber of Com Commerce here. We um, sponsor the uh, ice sculpturing. We sponsor the uh, lighting in the town at Christmas time. Uh, we have, after six months after we opened, we had a quarterly meeting from the Chamber of Commerce in our store, realizing we were a very nice, classy store. Um, to which, when I brought that letter of recommendation from the Chamber of Commerce to the, the East Long Meadow Planning Board, it meant nothing to them. Uh, they are still trying to get the bylaws to block me from going in there. So what's the situation in East Long Meadow? How does it stand? Where do you see it going forward from here? As of right now, it's up in the air. I did hire an um, engineering firm. They tend to feel that I will get in there because uh, I applied for it before they had bylaws, which they still, to this day, uh, do not have bylaws passed through the uh, selectmen yet. So it's, all, it's up in the air. I mean, I, until, until it's open, I won't uh, know either way. So, the store has a perception in some communities, and it may not be a good one. What do you say to people who, who don't want this store in their community? Well, that's true, um, and I will go back to, I understand why the laws are written the way they are from the 60s and 70s when they had more CD stores, but the industry has really cleaned themselves up. This store is 75% lingerie and 25% adult products. You don't see any of it from the street. We put our windows are like any lingerie store. We have mannequins and lingerie on the mannequins. Uh, the, the problem that the, what Islam Meadows is doing, they're just perpetuating the stereotype of a CD store by not letting me put the store in a mainstream area and putting it off in the back where nobody will go or it's CD. They, they've suggested even having people buzzed in, blacking out windows, making people park in the back, which just all perpetuates uh, a bad image of a store, which we are right on Main Street in Greenfield. So, and we've done quite well and we've been welcomed.